Okay, so this is Mark from Supreme Exterior Clean here. Uh, just going to highlight something for you which will hopefully help you to see the difference uh, that that moss and algae lichen can make to your roof. We're busy cleaning a roof here in, uh, in Wickham Gateshead and uh, I'm just going to show you the roof. So this is uh, part of the roof that we're cleaning. I'm, I'm up here at it. Um, and you can see we have a we have quite a large overhang on this part of the roof and, and a nice little alcove in here which keeps these tiles nice and dry now because these tiles are kept dry i mean you can look at them they look they look almost new there's no staining um no growth on them but the surface of them looks almost new now just move along a few inches look at that difference because this here is is part of the roof that gets uh, wet and as such uh, the organic growth just thrived in these conditions it's got this uh, you've got moss growing in all the place you've got more than algae but it's not just that it, we, i mean we're going to clean these and i'll come back up and i'll do another video after we've cleaned them and removed this this dark staining that you can see here but even once we've removed this dark staining you'll be able to see i mean i can i can see already in, in certain spots the the pitted effect that, the, that is on the tile and that's just purely because the the mold and algae has eaten away at these uh, at these tiles which has affected the surface um, so they can see just look massive difference I'll come back up once once this area has been cleaned just so we can uh, have a proper look at it and see the difference hi so it's Mark here from Supreme Exterior Clean again just said so we'll get a, uh, an after shot of this of this roof that we cleaned so just gonna now so again these were the tiles that we was I was saying uh, were kept dry because of this alcove here and as such didn't see uh, didn't get damp so wasn't a situation where the more algae could thrive now we'll move across to these tiles here which have now cleaned you can see they're clean a lot better than they were they were all black still a little bit of uh, moss cleaning them but we've chemically tried it that will uh, die and fall off, but you can still highlight the, just the difference on these tiles. You see, they take there's a rough appearance. That surface layer of that tile has been eaten away. Whereas we move across to the new ones, it's all nice, nice and smooth. So even though it's been cleaned, you can see where the surface layer has been eaten away, and we've actually got little bits of the aggregate uh, that make up the the tile uh, are starting to show through from that surface. So just to highlight that. Um, Prevention is better than the cure. Really, you're better off having your roof tread on a regular basis to stop the buildup of this mold and algae uh, from taking place. Because ultimately, even if you get, do get professionally cleaned, there, there is still a measure of damage that's being done. It's it's not it's not major, but there is a, a measure of damage there. So to keep your tiles in nice, pristine conditions like these ones, yeah, you want to uh, you want to make sure you have them regularly tread with a with a soft wash solution. So if you do ever want that done, then feel free to contact us at Supreme Exterior Clean and we can take care of that for you.